Mm. Now there go the heat right mm. there. Period. Mm. So yeah, it's she, not just like my mate. I'm not saying it like my mate. She said really, most just things. most men. I'm not gonna get their phone. I, to the counterpart, I don't think most women to get a phone up. Oh, because challenge. Because <laughs> if we gonna go <laughs> really like that, I'm just saying. <laughs> y'all are ten times faster than us. <laughs> we ten times smarter too. So I get my phone up. What you what you making it have personal? A, have a great day, King. Well, you ain't she ain't told you that. I got 50 yes. right now. You can't dial her up if she told no, you. No, for real. I, 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 I said ain't nobody thing called anymore. you. Ain't no, yes, no. Y'all ever see New Jack City? Ain't nobody. <laughs> <laughs> y'all ever see New Jack City? Man, you know ain't nobody. <laughs> <laughs> Tell you what's up. <laughs> I know damn well ain't nobody stuck your shriveled up. Everybody oh, out, you know, it's all in fun, baby. You know, everybody out there, stay dangerous. And that's and that shape was like, stay pow. So, yeah. Oh, how y'all doing? Yes. <laughs> who are y'all? What's going on? You know, you know, hello, people. What's going on? Hello. Who, are, going who on? are you? Who are you people? She came back with reinforcements. They got reinforcements. <laughs> she ain't not about to play this time. She came, she came back with reinforcements. So welcome to the Let Us Become Sharper slash TNS podcast. We are here again with Shay. Wheels. What's good, family? And Nina. Hello, hello, everybody. <laughs> yes, they are here. Another beautiful day of conversation, another beautiful day of topics and engagement. This is what we love. Now, we have a great topic for you today. As usual, a lot of the people, a lot of the supporters, a lot of the people who follow us and watch the watch the podcast and listen to us, they've been saying, you know, the topics and the, uh, the subject matter is is, is unique second to none and uh we really really enjoy and we really really like what you're doing so we appreciate that oh we got a uh, got the co-host here number one co-host the toxic avenger we got reno he's here with us and uh today he's going to present with a topic we use life experiences and we allow we allow life to come to us we don't go out searching for nothing but as in the course of a day, these things will come about. So we want to get our topic queued up. Let's let's get let's get going with that first. First and foremost, I want to say it's another to you. It's another one of those barn burner topics. Here we go. Start a little controversy. Uh, I like go. controversy in a few households. Okay. So today's topic is: Can you freely exchange cell phones with your partner? Mm, that's a good one. So yeah. to get a little more in depth than that, <laughs> can you roll over to your partner and say, "Baby, unlock your phone for me," while they sleep, or they just chilling and they hand it to you and do whatever they was doing? Or can your partner, vice versa, can your partner do that to you without, you know, okay. the worry or oh, is somebody gonna text me? Is it a message in there they right. shouldn't have seen? Is my phone gonna ring? Any of those kind of complications? Can you freely exchange phones with your well, partner? Well, let me let me talk on that. <laughs> I think that for me, I can only speak for me. I can only speak for majority, but you know, I'm sure it's plenty like me. You know, but I would say yes because I mean, I'm in a when you're in a committed, you know, relationship, and it's something we both said that we're gonna do. I feel like you really should have the full trust. It should be blind trust to where you shouldn't even be moving or acting as if. When they don't see, you know, it's about what he, what your true character is, really. So I think so. You know, that was, if you start that, looking for that was quick you negative, tell, then you, you gonna find you telling the truth. That was too quick. No, <laughs> Reno, you gonna learn what they call politically correct. Okay, okay. You gonna learn about politically correct answers, but I will say this: I have a I have a meter, a gauge. I have a meter uh, that I gauge by. I can sense that there's some truth in what she said. Yeah, it was, it was, I know. It was then, a. Yeah, I know. I know. I got done. She was like, "Let me yeah. go." I know. Because I got this. I know when they last. I know when they BSing me. I know when they BS me. Right? That sounded true and authentic. Thank now, you. what we want to do is we want to pause right here because this podcast, in my opinion, this is this is this is the life that I want to live. I mean, just look at us. You know, we're here. 
and everybody everybody's in just this positive mood this positive right, sinful right. sinful energy that's the hub of positive energy what we coin ourselves as so we don't bring no negativity here so i want to say this come on talk about it <laughs> when i was young yes we you know when shay come last time we had to get straight to it her scheduling but now she you know she comes it, she's already indicated she made a little more time for yeah it. she made a little more time <laughs> so now i can actually say something because i have i have something to say to my people everyone who support me is a lot i have a lot of supporters and we need many more but i want to say this when i was young when i was young mm. there was a group of kids around we would go we would play what's called i'm sure my age we play frozen tag freeze tag okay okay tags That's and like they okay. got the freeze. i think everybody in the room oh yeah that. yeah well yeah. you know I, i'm just saying so <laughs> You know, I'm just once we figure out, yeah, yeah. You, you know, all, you know, all about it. Catch a girl, kiss a girl. <laughs> uh oh, <laughs> all right, all right. You know, they right don't say nothing to incriminate because you know they go all the way back there. Right. You did, oh, you played that. So now, <laughs> so now, when I was young, so we would play frozen tag, freeze tag, and the young guys that I would pay, play with your little girls too, but mostly the guys you have to put your foot in and you say any, many, miny, mo. You know the game. Just what you got to do. You like, uh, uh, kind of out loud. I don't hear you. Yeah, yeah. You know, I was the one that got the so got the got the mumbling. You know, because uh -huh. I got to do my thing. So you know, you ain't touching the feet like this, right? So there was a there was a criteria. There was a standard back when I'm showing my age. Back when we playing freeze tag, frozen tag. This is when the threes come out, all black with the elephant skin, the Jordans I'm talking about now. It's when the threes come out. You are not allowed to put your foot in to play freeze tag if you didn't have those on your Oh, oh, y'all was exclusive little crew. You are not allowed to play tag, freeze frozen tag. You are not allowed to play freeze tag unless you had those on your feet. I'm going somewhere. I can't play with my case ones. <laughs> Somehow, some way, you were allowed to play. I don't know. Like I said, it's going to be incriminating. I don't know why we allowed you to play, but you was in. So we do it anyway. But you couldn't put your foot in without the number three Jordans on with the elephant skin around them. You couldn't do it. I done told you I'm showing my age. Now, why would you want to get up here? Come on, man. I'm a little, I'm a little confused, so I just was asking. You know, you I'm confused. trying to get clear. You ain't confused, boy. You know what's going on. So way back there. So the, the the point it's not about you know I, oh trust me I'm ancient it's not about it's the, the the matter of the fact is this for the young kid who I'm not going to use the word discriminated because when we don't necessarily discriminate you know even when you kids you try to you don't want to say that it's discrimination right yeah discrimination thing discriminate that's what it is but for the young boy that went home that had to go home or. He had to i don't know what i don't even know what it was i'm so busy we so i'm so busy trying not to be it that i'm not really seeing what he's doing but there were kids who didn't have him on i could imagine when he goes home he probably feels away but after he feels away so many times and once he gets a little bit older he begins to ask a question to whoever's in charge it could be mother father it could be grandparents but somebody where somebody ends up getting asked the question where am i at where, where am i at okay everybody else has them where, where where am i where i'm at and then they give him an answer huh you right there you case as you said you case you right there baby no no where i'm at where is the number three joy with the elephants where am i where i'm at that story that i tell is vital to these time, days and times. Don't ever ask someone where I'm at and they direct you somewhere else. Where I'm at? Oh, you're right there. That's not me. It has to be, it has to make sense. It has to fit the criteria of what, where am I? And a lot of the times we're accepting answers. Never me, but we're accepting answers that do not fit the criteria of where I'm at. So everybody listen, I want you to ask that question. Where I'm at? Where am I? You're saying that you're looking out for me, but where I'm at? I don't feel looked out for. 
So I want to put that out there as a blanket statement for anybody who listens. Where I'm at, where am I? That's going to be key for this year, next year, and for days to come. You have to know where I'm at. If you got a stake, where I'm at, you come in. Where I'm at, dog? We got to be eating steak, all four of us, if, if meat eaters or whatever. We got to be living a certain way. So I want to set a standard for living and a standard and a standard for the way that you should be treated when you come to my barbershop. You don't have to worry about where I'm at. I have someone greet you at the door. That's right. When you come into my shop, you greet it at the door for everybody out there who asks where I'm at. Well, I got some place for you. You can come see me. I get greedy with Kevin Hart. Yeah, dude. Oh, every Thursday. Mm -hmm. In a full... Yeah. Kevin Hart, the Kevin Hart tequila, Grand Carmino. Definitely. Yes, Grand Carmino. Shout out Kevin Hart. Mm -hmm. Shout out my Kevin Hart, yeah. When I developed my tequila, I wanted to do something different. So I partnered with someone who thought different. Introducing Grand Coromino, a Cristalino tequila. Hard work tastes different. I didn't just put my name on this. This is real for me. I love tequila. So much that I had to make my own. But love will only take you so far. You want great? You go out and get great. This is Grand Coromino tequila Cristalino. Man, Caramino. Shout out Kevin Hart. Mm -hmm. Shout out my Kevin Hart, yeah. So we, we have to understand we have a default i have a default setting i have something in place it might not be this this grandiose but i have something where you never have to ask where i'm at come see cj come see me i got you greeted at the door now you will engage in topics you will engage in conversations it might not be cameras around but we still continue to be this way and keep this positive energy even when the camera is off we don't do it for the cameras this is what we do now we have have it on microphones and cameras now, in the middle of the day, you might ask another question. All right, that, that was beautiful in, in the morning. You know, we started off today, but what's going on? No, I got something for you in the middle of the day as well. I have something for you in the middle of the day and the end part of the day. And oh, what you got over there? What's you, where I'm at? Oh, man, what? No, where I'm at? <laughs> where, <laughs> see, that was the energy yeah. universe just coming to show. Now, where I'm at, I heard some crunch, and I don't. And I'm look at me, I'm dry. <laughs> you got the lay shit. So come on, come, come on. Where I'm at, in the middle of the day, we have you all set up. We have that. We have a high level for you. We have something beautiful for you. And at the end of the day, we have what's called a VIP lounge. Mm -hmm. So this is how the day is set up when you come ask a question. Where I'm at. How let CJ? I got something for you. Beautiful. I'm build. I'm building. Now, back to the topic. That's roll. That was back, let, let's be, <laughs> appreciate that. Now, it. Let, it has. It had to be said. Now let's roll. Now we want to get back to the topic. We are talking about the cell phone, correct? All right. We want to hear you. We want. We want to hear. Can you hand your cell phone on? Okay, so with that, I would say that yes, yes, I would um, hand over my cell phone. You I would have no problem with, with no that. conviction, no restrictions, no restrictions, no convictions. But um, I can't say the same for him though. Oh, whoa. <laughs> whoa. Ooh, shots fired. Whoa. Shots fired. No, 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 no. I'm, she's just, talking saying, about, she's, I'm just saying the, the, uh, the mate. I can't say the same, oh, but you know. Like, no. That's, that's not true. Oh. No, no, no. I was looking at my phone and I heard it for him. So, like, <laughs> I was, uh, yeah, I, I, I was, I was like, no, I'm whoa. just saying. Whoa. The other person. Yeah, the person is all I'm saying. You're not sure if they can do the same. Right, right. Yeah, just hand over the cell phone. So you confident with, in that? Absolutely. Yeah, with, with, with confidence. No, no, no. That, you confident you cool and okay with the fact that you don't feel like he can um i mean i wouldn't even ask for your cell phone though like unless it was a situation where you know what i mean i needed to ask um but just on a random i'm not i'm not about to ask you to see your phone and i don't expect for somebody to ask me to see mine unless it was like needed if yeah, if, sure. if you know if they had some suspicion or something but just on a random let me see your phone like why <laughs> but I mean, if you want to, okay. <laughs> I mean, but that, what that, I do, I be good. Right, right, right. <laughs> I mean, that's the thing, though. Like, it shouldn't have to be a, a, a premise behind it. Like, mm -hmm. maybe let me see your phone. Mm -hmm. But why? Right. The I, I guess I'm with Nino on that one. But why? Why no, would no, no, I'm, I'm, Listen, hold up. Let, let's be clear. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm just the other side of the coin. Right. Because like, somebody yeah. thinking that. Yeah. Somebody like, well, well, why do it got to be a reason that I need your phone? 
is what I'm saying. Like, that's that's what we do. If these I ask, for. can I do if it? If I ask, can I do it? Or you gonna be like, hold it. on, let me delete something real quick, or or yeah. can I just catch you out the whim like that? Yeah. That yeah. Yeah. Well, can, well, can, well, 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 wait a minute. Let me. Because the yeah. the basis was, can you just roll over and be what? like, baby, let me let me see your phone while they sleep, and you're like, here, and go back to sleep. I yeah, I gotta so. <laughs> Once again, I got to roll on this side of the fence. But oh, yeah. why? Because yeah, right. a lot of people do it. Because speaking for one side of the people, so I'm speaking for the other side. Oh, it's people God. that feel like, for whatever reason, they not confident they make, they don't trust they make, or because they doing some BS, yeah. which make you sketchy of the other person. You feel right. me? So I, I, I don't have a... a I, let me I, explain I, something. Hold on before we go in front. Let me explain something. I don't have no... no see right there? No. I don't have time for no Jedi mind trick where one person is doing something and then that's transferring for me to say that you're doing something and place skepticism on someone else. No, 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 no. If you want to see the phone or if I ask to see the phone, maybe it's just at random. Sometimes I want to check up and see how you live. Yep. Maybe that's what I wanted to see. I got something with that. I mean, that's okay. Yeah, I, I truly feel like... Yeah, but that was dubious. She still want to know why. I feel like people are a reflection of what, like, whatever you your mind takes you to, that's what you are. So it's like if you're a positive person, like I like to live in gratitude and happiness, then you don't look for the negative, or you're not even gonna try to even assume it's gonna be negative because you're gonna you're gonna basically be the example that you feel like it should be. So it's like if I'm always being toxic and looking for toxicity, that's what I'm gonna breed. I'm always like I got blind trust. He gonna do right by me. I'm gonna do right by him. We both took an oath and commitment, you know. And so what happened and, when that backfired though? Then that's what I'm, what I'm saying is you got to have that you got to go into stuff like that because if not you're going to be bringing baggage from other relationships or whatever so you got to go into it. if you're going to say i'm gonna do this you got to do it if not do it then you might as well stay single and bitter why well, you say single single and bitter <laughs> you stay single. I mean, you're gonna hold on to shit bring the baggage into something else right that's what it's going to be you're not healed completely because if you come into something whole i ain't worried about what happened last with them right you know what i'm saying you can't come in here with that energy because i ain't did shit to you I get it. I get it. I get it. I see, I see where that's going. So <laughs> when when we when we on the podcast, what we try to do is we try to keep a tally. We, let's be clear. You you come right out, you know, and said that you have no problem with right. with if your husband mm -hmm. said, "Hey, see that cell phone right quick at the middle of your sleep." You got no problem with that. No wake me up. Okay. Yeah, wake you up. Yeah, he 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 added the the, the element of wake yeah. you up, meaning no preparation. Right. You wake up and then boom. So then that makes the, the question is, should you ask? Or is it sneaking if you just grab it and you be like, I mean, I ain't sneaking. I was no, we asking. You know? We asking. Yeah, we, coming, right. we asking. Right. We coming straight here. We, right, we right, asking. Right. We ain't, you know, I mean, you got we, the ain't cold? Breaking, we ain't breaking boundaries. <laughs> well, see, now, the now that's another topic. <laughs> you got the cold. That's another, another topic. Got Do the they cold? got the cold? Because if you got the cold, there's no reason I should ever have to ask. There what? you go. Why do you have a cold? On your phone? Yeah, my kids be my phone. Got you. you know, okay. I ain't gonna lie to you. Because like, it's my phone. Yeah, <laughs> and then I don't want nobody to pick my stuff up. I mean, I, you know, yeah. A lot of sensitive information plus the kids. For that me. too, like, for sure. Yeah. And kids being your stuff. Okay. You know. So we like to keep a tally. <laughs> so we say that you don't have a problem with handing over your phone, your device. I don't got a problem. I'm with her. That's right. You can have my shit. You can have it. Take it. That's I how you got a problem. That's how you feel. That's how I'm giving it up. Mm. At this point in my life, mm. okay, that's how I'm giving this it. Where up. You at right now, that ain't where I was at my whole life. That ain't where I was at ten years ago or okay. nothing. But at this present point, the last few okay. years of my life, here you go. Agreed. I ain't always been there either. You know, take take time. the phone, hand it right over, boom, go right in there. Listen, I can really say that I done been woke up. Like, let me see your phone right quick. And not even like she was on no searching. She was her phone was dead. She was waiting on it to come back, but she was trying to call somebody right fast. Mm. Uh, I <laughs> yeah. went to sleep. I heard her. Hello. All right. Mom, I'm about to leave out the house right now. I and, put a and, and she you, threw and, it back on my leg. And, and, you, and, and you didn't <laughs> hand the phone like this. Right, right, right. I was asleep. <laughs> I didn't even think about it. I opened my eyes so to unlock and gave her the phone. And I laid back down because I ain't in there. Shut that screen ain't that. You know how you <laughs> right, right. You keep your eyes man, open. Man, man. Man, man, your eyes open. Who I like that shit? I ain't had no 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 oh, issues and no worries. Me personally, you know what I'm saying? Man, oh man. I've been to wake her up before. I got stories. I've been the person to be like, hey, let me talk to you for a minute. So uh 
uh, who is uh, you know, but that ain't a beautiful place to be. I've been there though. I'm just saying, like that. I've, gr- I've, that. I've grown from that. That is not beautiful. It's not a good thing. I was hurt on the inside. Wow. Hurt people, hurt people. You understand? That is true. They do. They do. <laughs> that is true. I don't think that I, I don't think that hurt people have a choice but to hurt. That's people it. There's so shit. much hurt exuding from the inside. That's right. right. You know, whatever whatever is in, in the heart is going to ex- in the mind is going to exude That's on right. the outside. That so and on our panel, we keep in. So we we, we taking a, a tally. So we're gonna hit you with, you don't mind. I don't mind. Now he's gonna elaborate, but he elaborated enough, he so did. we'll give you. So you don't mind either. Boom. No, I'm kind of you iffy on me. I'm iffy <laughs> on you. I'm not. I'm not gonna sit up here. I'm not gonna sit up here in front. <laughs> I'm not all the way convinced about you because you asked why. What? And when you put the why in there, <laughs> uh oh, that's Uh-oh. always kind of. Yeah, she like elaborate. Yeah, well, she elaborated already, but I just, you know, when it comes to these types of issues, it's not about elaborate. I'm kind of, <laughs> I'm kind of refuting the whole statement. Ooh. I'm thinking you more of a no. Whoa. I'm thinking you, I'm thinking <laughs> you are saying. No, like what you want my phone for? Yeah, like, that's, like, I think I can see through the, 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 the need and all the data. <laughs> what you need is well, I still let you see it. No, I don't, I don't believe. I, oh, my God. Did I do it like <laughs> that? Yeah, I mean, all black. All I'm black just shirt. Saying, yeah. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Every night. That's how I feel, Powerful. though. Why? Because I wouldn't ask you for your phone unless it was, like, a serious reason. Like, So you said you ain't giving the reason. No, I believe asked. in consequences. Like, if you do something and you get caught, then it's a consequence behind it. But, but other than that, I'm not I'm not about to be all in your phone. I'm just not. So just don't get caught, because if yeah, I found out, I got caught. consequences. Wait, wait a minute, wait. Because if you... If most I know you weren't just going to let that just yeah, let's slow this down. believe let's in consequences. No, no, no. Yeah. That's we go, powerful. We go, we go hit a little reverse, buddy. He said that, that, was that was powerful. I believe in consequences. It wasn't that powerful because... After her decision <laughs> to give her phone up, she said, I don't think the partner could get his phone up. So is that out of knowing that you're going to find something and you just using that as the, you know, the not at all. The buffer? Just, for me, I don't think most men would give up their phone. Period. Mm. Ooh, now there go the heat, right there. Mm. Period. So yeah, it's she, not just like my mate. I'm not saying it like my mate. She said really, most just most that. men. I'm not going to give up their phone. I, to counterpart, I don't think most women to get a phone up. Oh, because challenge. Because <laughs> if we gonna go really like that, I'm just right. saying. <laughs> Y'all are ten times faster than us. We ten times smarter too. So I get my phone up. <laughs> I'm just saying. Because what you dealing with, you don't feel like he'll catch it. <laughs> you saying that's the, that's the that's the head special style like she coming from? Yeah, like oh, I he, I put that that shade. He ain't gonna peep that. <laughs> I mean, I ain't because say when you see but... Shay, he he gonna keep going. You looking for Rick or or Martez <laughs> or or Uncle Lou? I'm Louis, just saying, women are a little smarter on that. Like we go through y'all phone and, and they just find everything. We just call them <laughs> Nikki in there, Keisha. <laughs> hey, like Keisha one, you Keisha two. Stop it! <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> You right in, 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 in a lot of in a lot of you know be situations. Careless dudes, stuff like that. Like, they be careless. I like don't that. think she gonna ask for my phone. So I'm gonna just shoot my move. It's my phone. Like you said, it's my phone until it ain't your phone. <laughs> until it's your phone, and she like, hey bro, let me let me hear you. I like that right quick. Until that and night, you like, come uh, 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 in uh, uh, from the club. Too drunk. Until you get arrested, Man. you gotta turn and, your phone into your family. And <laughs> then she, that's a bad. <laughs> Oh, your right. family gotta phone take check. your stuff. Phone check. I need to call, baby, because you, you're going in there. What's the call? Turn. <laughs> you gotta turn your property over. Go. I wouldn't mind giving mine the code. You I, I code wouldn't mind either. Yeah, but I, so I y'all special. I wouldn't mind. Y'all special. <laughs> now, like I say, it's a lot of it's a lot of people who can't say that, but I'm speaking for the majority of because my mind said is we, we we treat people right around here. You know what I'm saying? We love our black kings. And, you know, yeah, I don't play games. For sure, we ain't play games. If I'm saying I'm committed, I'm in this. If I'm no, not, I ain't special. in it. Yeah, yeah. Well, just just from that statement right there, that's that's special. That's something beautiful that I heard today. We talking about positive energy, for sure. So that was that was definitely a a hit. Uh, that was like a shot of positive energy, just like ah, like a shot, like man. We need, that little, right, right. We need a little dose right quick to hear. You know the word king. Like I was that's saying right. about my amenities. Hold on, freeze the game. That's what I was saying about my amenities. When you come, when you come see CJ, you will hear the word king used. <laughs> that's right. Talking about you. When is the last time? 
that, and I'm talking about the men now, when is the last time that you were referred to as king? Mm -hmm. Wow, I was hoping. This is what I'm talking about with my amenities. In the morning, like I tell you, you get greeted at the door, like I said before. You will engage in topics and conversations. And in the middle of the day, you I will take you back to my reference, which is called The Boss. Yes, it's one of my earthly examples and one of my references that I use. It's called The Boss. But when is the last time that you men were called the word king? When, when the word king was said from a woman and they were talking about you. Yeah. Now, we, we done took a tally. You said that you're going to hand the phone over. He says that he's going to hand the phone over. Nina says that she's not going to hand the phone Ooh, over. Oh, he just going to yeah, stick Yeah, I ain't got time to keep playing no games with you. I told you I'm powerful. Now, I ain't got time to play with you. I can see through you. If you say so, <laughs> you, you will not give up the phone. Yeah, right, right, talking right. about the words that she used, consequences. These are all real words. It is consequences. <laughs> yeah, it's red flags. Now. As he takes a break, he has because the conversation has got a little too intense. <laughs> conversation has gotten a little intense. What about you, sir? <laughs> oh, what, what oh. about you? Oh, 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 oh. She, oh. I was headed there. Okay. <laughs> oh, I was headed. I was headed there. <laughs> now, let me tell you about says, you. Give it. Let the phone, me right? tell you about me. Let me adjust so you can understand. <laughs> There's no way. <laughs> let me let me make clear. Uh -uh. I put you out of no because I didn't want to be alone. <laughs> There's no way. Okay, now I understand. There's no <laughs> way. Oh, you gonna stand? There's no <laughs> way that I'm handing over my cell phone. Many things in my cell phone. Ooh, ooh, okay. That there's no <laughs> way. Love I gotta tell right. the truth. There's no the way truth. that I'm handing over my gotta cell phone. Now, do I make good on these incriminating things that are in my phone? Uh oh, that's how you the, make good? That's 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 the deal. That's at your discretion. But I will say this. <laughs> I will no longer, I will not hand over my phone because there are times that this could be spin off to a whole nother topic, a whole nother genre, a whole nother, a whole nother. No different than Nina telling me that she would hand over the phone and I'm not seeing the point. I'm not believing <laughs> what she's saying. That I go out, you know, as far as uh, cheating or as far as trying to talk to someone else or getting numbers, or I'm past all of that. But at the end of the day, I'm not giving up my phone because I might have somebody that I'm communicating with on something different. And she'll take that and look at that the wrong way. So stay out of my phone and I'll stay out of yours. Right. We've both been in each other's. Oh, we done been Catch in the phone. Me. Catch me. Yeah, just, 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 don't even, just don't even worry about my phone. No, I'm not unlocking it. No, you, no. No, no, you can't open your eyes. You know, yeah. that face recognition. You got to take your eyes Yeah, on. no, I'm not opening my phone. Okay. No. And if you need to use a phone, here, I got this. Got this I got this shooter. Got Go the ahead. Phone. Yeah. One, got a shooter. You've never seen a phone on 102%. Oh, my God. It's been, be it's been on the charger in the truck forever. Wait. Yes, yeah, it's Christmas. <laughs> wait, Just wait for, for this moment. Wait for the day you needed to use a phone. Oh, I got you right here. With the number going to that. You can put me, you know, like I said last time, our panel was, was across the board. It was in agreement. We all agree that unanimous. the women, is unanimous decision, that the women take the pain better. Absolutely. This time around, not so unanimous. You're not looking. You're not. I'm not playing phone games with you. Just live. I got. I got a rule in this. You know. I don't. I don't try to bring my personal relationship into the podcast. But I will just one time. How I live. I, we we got our own life. Yeah. That's we got. Right. And then we meet up in the middle. I guess you could call it being cordial. We have a cordial point. Understanding. That, understanding that we meet at in the middle. But for the most part, we have our own life. And in, in a heated argument, we don't even. We don't even really argue for. But we right. have had some exchanges in the past right. where it had to be known, hey, I got my own life. And ain't nobody going to tell me that you got your own life and I'm not letting you know I got my own life. For real, for real. The long way I got my own life. You know, y'all y'all, really came in here politically correct today. Goody two shoes, I guess. I ain't politically correct. I just oh, keep it real. Oh. He said we did it I was keeping, too. She don't want to be alone. Too. She, she definitely like, yeah. wasn't correct. She said she ain't giving it up. Ah, okay, y'all just go. Ah, that's how y'all feel about me, no? Come on to the dark side, Nina. Come on to the dark side. You I would absolutely give up my phone. So you would give it up? Yes. But you won't ask for it. No, I wouldn't. Nope. 
I why would, though? I need to know why you won't ask for it. Why should I? I would. Like, what reason am I? What, what What am I looking for? Because usually, when you look, you you gonna find something. Yeah, I ain't never looking, but I'm just like like I just don't believe in in looking for something because you may find. So I'm gonna just be happy. I'm gonna be happy in the moments that you know I can be happy in it. And when something happens, then you know you got to make choices on what you are gonna do about it. That's Dang. that's it. That's powerful. Mm, yeah. now, now that's powerful. Mm, yeah. Now that is podcasting history. That was that was beautiful. That was a beautiful, sure. that was a beautiful statement because that's a, I believe that she just articulated the way that I live. I was just stating earlier. It took a break. I was stating earlier about how we have our own lives, and then we meet in the middle, kind of cordial. What right. she said kind of just kind of redefined, rehash what what I just what said. said. We just gonna be happy in the moments we can be happy, right. and 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 just live that way. And I, and and I will say that's this. a beautiful way to live, though. That's like, a beautiful way. To live. Yeah, that's, that's a beautiful. Way to yeah, live. we actually became sharper just now. Do you yeah, feel it? Do you yeah. feel it? Do you feel it? Yeah, she, she, I feel it. She tightened us up a little bit. I feel it. We became sharper. I told you she went for reinforcements. <laughs> yeah, we, we we became we became sharper. I got, the, I got to talk in history and all that on her last week. Like, oh, let me let me get some reinforcement. Yeah, about your history lesson. So please don't start one. No, I don't got no. Wait a minute, whatever the high five <laughs> because Kyrie left Brooklyn, you want to be so in eyes with me right now. Okay, then, so let's then get we can't high, yeah. we can't high five. What are you doing here? Right, right, right. so so yeah, we, we, <laughs> we don't got that right now. Oh, let me adjust. So let's get to that. So what's up with your man? Get your man's dog. That's your man. You be defending <laughs> him. You defend him every time Boy, we come in here. Why you quiet? Hold on. He still my man. You, you want to do that? You gonna let me? Talk? I'm gonna let you finish. Go no, ahead. I'm good. Come on. <laughs> He's still my man. Yeah, you want to do some sports? And, so let's get and, it. And I feel like, like I always say, even in, even in private and shop, he did what he felt like was best for him. Because at the end of the day, those are corporations and those people do what's best for See, them. what you're not going to do is you're not going to come in here with no blanket answer. No, that, that's a real answer. That's man. what a serial killer says. I did what I, I did best. What, <laughs> not a serial I did, killer. I did, I did what I best. had to do. I did best. <laughs> What I felt I had to do. There you go. <laughs> that's, a, a, that's a he that, got to the he got to a answer. better situation. Brooklyn wasn't trying to give him a serial contract. killer again. I got to a better situation. Uh -oh. was Brooklyn wasn't to trying to give him the max that contract to... that he was asking for. So he asked for the trade. He gonna get over there at the end of the season. Mm -hmm. He a free agent across the it's board. It's about what's best for you and your your legacy, your household and stuff. Honestly, that's true. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness, my brother. How could how how did I lose you? How could you be so lost? I've been lost. How could you be so lost? <laughs> I've been lost. <laughs> Let me tell you something. You better become sharper before the podcast get took over. That's what you better do. We step our game up, man, because they coming in. Wow, oh, cool. Playing. You just won one game, not one. Me. They're not playing one game. So listen, man. You sitting over here support. You the number one Kyrie advocate supporter. Still all support you, Kyrie. Shout all out Kyrie. You, all you do is make excuses. <laughs> and I wonder how I lost you years. How did I lose you along the way? All you do is make excuses. I just bought all my you son make some of them gym shoes. Yeah. Great great shoes to play in. Oh, yeah. My son practicing them <laughs> twice a week. You know another shooter that was good to play in? The Chuck Taylor. Yeah, the, the yeah, Chucks. You might, you might, you might break your <laughs> ankle. That was the shoe that was available at the time. The Chucks and Chuck never and Chuck Taylor never that touched the basketball. That ain't cute. So they never. can, so they can sell you anything. They at the end of the day, you like what you like for fashion. But I'm talking about reality. You keep on cute. making excuses. LeBron's available, but they don't be really playing. Oh, that's a number one seller across around the world. You don't stop. Lifetime Nike contract. What more do you want? <laughs> or is he's it, a stand-up guy all around and they, I love his positivity how you don't see him in no scandal he put his his family first and he's a positive you know he just he give what, it, what he's supposed to give no I respect it no scandals you know oh, that's a that's a solid black king right there and I love oh, his family man. shout out to him and the people you know LeBron James you know what shout out to LeBron James because I don't want to don't want to come across as a LeBron hater <laughs> Because That's he finally he finally got somebody across the table from him that you know give him That's the same. Energy. So <laughs> I don't want to give me an air right, LeBron like that. Like, <laughs> no. LeBron invented those. <laughs> Back in the old days, you had to really touch. Yeah, you know but man. LeBron came along. He was like, "Oh, we can simplify that." Yeah. No disrespect to LeBron. I'm not a LeBron <laughs> hater. No, yes, you are. Uh -oh. Yes, but, you are. But you know. It's like a person saying, no, I don't mean no harm, but they mean no harm. 
whenever somebody start off, <laughs> yeah, I don't yeah, mean yeah. no harm. No harm, they mean no harm. Prepare to be harmed. <laughs> right. Soon as, as soon as a person say, <laughs> where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Like, what you what? 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 Yeah, she ain't going to hit. She's not giving up herself. No, no. You, you, you make so many excuses, like I said. So, uh -huh. so it, it, it's just part of your character. So, to recap, yes, yeah, so our supporters, we want to talk to our supporters for just, just, just for a minute. We're getting so much support. All cash is verified. What that means is anything coming in or going out is verified. It's as simple as that. We have supporters. We have sponsors. We have Can an aged tequila taste both complex and smooth? The answer is perfectly clear. Introducing Grand Coromino, a Cristalino tequila. Hard work tastes different. We have a lot of people that are willing and ready to help us with this podcast to keep this thing going. It's, it's definitely therapeutic for me, something that I love to do. We love the panel that we have here today. Sure. Many, many more continued podcasts in the future. It's be full, y'all, next week. For yeah, they're they gonna keep. They're gonna keep. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So we like to thank everybody who's with us and who and who's been following us and staying with us thus far, and all those in the future that choose to do so. We appreciate you from the bottom of my hearts. Now, let's get the recap, man. So we got we we got a we got a split panel. We got two no. And two yes on can you just hand the cell <laughs> phone split, over people. and just <laughs> open split. up the cell phone and just let your partner just go through that thing. But just, yeah, we got a split decision. But <laughs> we want everybody out there to ask that question. Well, are you willing to just hand over your cell phone and let the person next to you just go through there? Maybe they got to make a phone call. Maybe they want to look at some apps. Who knows why they want the phone? Are you willing to relinquish power of your cell phone? and give it to the person that's next to you, meaning your partner, your significant other, your wife, your husband. Are you willing to do so? Think about that. Mm. And, and, why you, and, why you, and why you thinking about that? Also think about this. Mm. When is the last time that you were called? When is the last time that the word king was used and the person that said it, the woman specifically, was referring to you? And when is the last time that the word queen was used by a man and they were saying it in reference to you. This is just a question, not even a topic. This is a question that I put out there because we like to provide right in the middle of our right in the middle of our podcast. Uh, a topic was birthed. The question was birthed. We want to ask that's what you was dealing with. <laughs> you wouldn't sit up here and cover for somebody who jumps around and hops and hops and hops every time they get whooped. Got one ring, and the your only man, ring he got was with been, LeBron. Your man been on teams too. No, no, no. My man was on one team. Huh? When is the last time that you were referred to as a queen? <laughs> we gonna go back to the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't got time. I don't. You'll, you'll, I you'll learn. You'll learn soon. Don't. All right. <laughs> when is the last time that they said these pow? Like the way you said powerful. Say it like that again. This morning. That was powerful the way you said. Powerful. Oh, the way I said it. Yeah. Again. Everybody like the way I said. It. I didn't get the kick out of it. Everybody like didn't. It. Yeah. Powerful. Powerful. I love it. This the last. The last this time. Morning. What you, what you making it have personal? A, have a great day, King. Man, you ain't, she ain't told you that. I got 50 yes. right now. You can't dial her up if she told no, you. No, for real. I, 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 I said <laughs> ain't nobody called anymore. you. Hey, no, Y'all ever seen New Jack City? Ain't nobody. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all ever seen New Jack City? Man, you know ain't nobody. <laughs> So everybody oh, out, you know, it's all in fun, baby. You know, everybody out there, stay dangerous. And as and as shape was like, stay powerful. Stay powerful. Stay, powerful. stay strong in this game. Don't let nobody uh have you out here thirsty, ask and hungry, asking where I'm at. Don't let nobody do you like that. Know where you are, know who you are at all times. Mm -hmm. Have that established. That's and right. Who's you are. And whose you are. That have all of these things in order. I could call you having your ducks in a row. You stay dangerous out there. Don't let nobody manipulate you. Stay powerful. Thursday. That's how we do it. That's how we do on it. That's how we do on this podcast. Thursday. So continue to live fruitfully. Continue to live festively. And let us become sharper. <laughs>